New tonight, a controversial Arkansas Senate bill initially aimed at regulating drag performances is closer to becoming law. The bill passed the House this afternoon, but it looks a lot different from how it was originally written. Five News reporter Catherine Gilker in the studio now to help break it all down for us tonight. Catherine. Senate Bill 43 has been amended to no longer include the word drag in the title, which takes some of the emphasis off of LGBTQ events. Even though it did pass the House today, some people still say there are issues with the bill. Senate Bill 43 was amended to define an adult-oriented performance as a performance that is intended to appeal to the prurient interest and that features a person who appears in a state of nudity or is semi-nude. The original version of the bill only focused on classifying drag performances as adult-oriented businesses. This bill would prohibit so-called adult-oriented performances from taking place on public property or anywhere a minor can view them. Representative Mary Bentley is one of the bill's co-sponsors. She says it's about protecting the innocence of children. Meanwhile, Representative Tippy McCullough says there are lots of problems with the bill, including the word prurient and the definition of public property. We have a number of students on prescription antidepressants, children that are addicted to drugs and committing suicide. The number of youth struggling with gender identity has skyrocketed, and we continue to see an increase in child molestation and children trapped in sex trafficking. We used to cherish the, protect, the innocence of our children and do everything we could possibly do to protect it. I think if people are going to get penalized for doing something, they should understand what the parameters are of that and what the definitions are and the terms in the bill. I'm also quite confused about criminal or civil penalties in this, um, in this bill. I also think it's very vaguely written and that it's redundant as far as a lot of the obscenity laws go. Since the bill passed the House this afternoon, it will go to the Senate sometime later this week. Katherine Gilker, 5 News.